What is going on guys welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today we're going to check out all the new Iron Banner Season 3 ornamented gear and also check out how this badass loot is obtained but before we do that people if you do enjoy the video hitting that like button truly helps me and my channel out and I do appreciate that support you sexy bunch of mofos okay so if you didn't know you can actually see all the new Iron Banner ornamented gear for Season 3 in game right now and they look pretty badass. On screen now we can see the Hunter gear, Warlock and Titans will follow. So for this great looking Hunter helmet you need to reach a rank 25 this season. Ranks are no doubt packages open during the season, for each package you open you will get a rank. With matches in the Iron Banner during Season 3 to earn this ornament, it's unlocked to the Iron True Age cask, helm and hood. It's called the Waylorn's Iron Mask and in total you need 25 wins. The Hunter Season 3 ornament for the Gauntlets is called the Galleon's Iron Grips. For this you need to reach a rank 15 this season. Complete challenges in Iron Banner during Season 3 to earn this ornament is unlocked to the Iron True Age Grips, Gauntlets and Gloves. Somehow, and I don't know how, but I have done 14 challenges so far. In total you need 21 challenges. The Hunter Iron Banner ornamented chest piece for Season 3 is called the Piran's Iron Caress. To obtain this you need to defeat Iron Banner enemies with power weapons during Season 3. This is unlike to the Iron True Age vest, plate and vestments. In total you need 100 power weapon kills. The Hunter Leg Armor Ornament for Season 3 is called the Hacken's Iron Strides. For these you need to reach a rank 10 during the season. Also defeat Iron Banner enemies with supers during Season 3 to earn this ornament. It's unlocked to the Iron True Age Boots, Greaves and Legs and in total you need 100 kills. The Hunter Season 3 Ornamented Cloak is called Ephrodite's Iron Cloak. For this you need to reach a rank 5 during the season and you get it for opening 5 packages like it says, earn 5 ranks and it is unlocked to the Mantle of Ephrodite, Radagast's Iron Stash and the Timmy's Iron Bond. Now once you do these on one character you will get them across all three of your characters. So if you have one Hunter, one Warlock and one Titan, if you do all these on your Titan they will unlock for your Hunter and Warlock. On screen now you can see the Titan gear and the Warlocks will follow suit. Now I'm pretty sure they haven't announced when the next Iron Banner event will return but I'm guessing it will be within the next few weeks and I cannot wait to get grinding people more so than I am now which is absolutely crazy but it's what we all wanted, we wanted that grind back in Destiny 2 and I guess now we have it, we may as well enjoy it while we can guys because it probably won't last too long. But what do you think of these new Season 3 ornaments for the Iron Banner gear? Let me know down below within that comment section. I actually thought we'd get new armor to farm for too. We actually might do, we just have to wait and see. But I'm guessing because they've applied ornaments to the old gear we probably won't see new armors. But we will see a whole new host of new weapons which I do look forward to seeing and grinding for. And on that note guys I am out. Thanks as always for stopping by. If you enjoyed the video leaving a like truly helps me and my channel out. If you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos be sure to subscribe and hopefully people I will see you on that next one.